<laughs> Welcome back everyone. I'm back in the F90 M5. And boy, I miss those pops and bangs, man. This car sounds so good. I really missed it. But I never told you guys what happened with this car. I sold the M5 to one of my best friends. Uh, he's gonna stay anonymous. He doesn't like being in the limelight. Uh, but if you guys see this car, know that it's not me, it's him. He's making a ruckus, not me. You know, my best friend was bitching to me about how I didn't service the car before I gave it to him. So that's what we're gonna do today. We're gonna give him an oil change. I wanted to give him the best oil change because that's what best friends do. Now, uh, I heard that Motul has a new 300V. So this 300V engine oil is uh, something that Motul came out with at the end of last year for their 50th anniversary. They use it in all the racing cars, cars that have higher performance. This is qualified as a pretty badass super sedan, so I'm gonna try that oil. I'm gonna see if the 300V oil can really let this engine work to its peak potential and peak power. So we're gonna go to CPA right now and change the oil, get a dyno. But meanwhile, I am going to enjoy this drive and this exhaust. Peace. <laughs> we are back at CPA. We are ready to change the oil. CPA Performance is a partner of Motu Oils. The boss of CPA, Xiaohe, he really recommended Motu Oils. They are organic based and they are biofuels compatible. So for the 50th anniversary, Motu has come out with a new package. This new package is a tin can instead of the old plastic bottles that they used before. But also, there's a new 300V formula that they split up into three different types of oil. So for the basic oil, which is called power, it starts with 0W8 to 5W30. Now, we are actually going to use the competition series, which starts with 0W40 to 15W50. But for the M5, we are going to use 5W40. Every car will use a different spec oil, so make sure you do your own research and you get it right. The top of the line, Le Mans version, is for race cars, and that is 10W60 to 20W60. But if you want more information, the link is down below. Let's go change the oil to the M5 and let's get the dyno going. Peace. Sometimes it's better to do things by yourself, but I didn't drain it. I didn't drain the oil. Yeah, I'm a poser. So the M5 is on the dyno. We are ready to do some pulls, but I'm actually gonna let you guys know what I did with the M5 before I sold it. When we got the dyno done with the previous ECU, I noticed some areas where I wanted to kind of tinker a little bit and adjust. I asked Xiao He Laoban how I could actually have a custom tune. And he actually recommended MG Flasher. Their specialists were able to work with us and we could tell them what we wanted from the drivability, the performance, even the temperatures. And we were able to communicate, let them know what we wanted out of the M5. What's even cooler is you just download the app on your phone or the iPad and you can customize it with the specialist at MG Flasher. Obviously, you can do it right here at CPA Performance as well. So, Xiao He Laoban, Xiao He Laoban. I mean, this is actually really brilliant because uh, even if you don't have a software engineer, someone to write your map for you, to rewrite the ECU for you, uh, you can actually just tinker with it yourself. Ah. 
<laughs> so you have three options. So that's really funny because I'm thinking about messing with my best friend. Uh, I just found out that you can control the pops and bangs with the loudness, the length of the pops and bangs. You know what? I'm just going to put it on max setting after we do the dyno run. So when my best friend drives it, I think everyone around him is going to get really pissed off. <laughs> I can actually adjust the torque of each gear. So let's say you're doing mountain driving and you want to adjust it and you don't want the Newton meter to be so high up in first gear or second gear. You can actually adjust it, you know, from third and fourth. This is brilliant. This is honestly really brilliant. If you guys are interested in MG Flasher for your BMW or AMG, go to CPA, ask for Shahul Alban. Just letting you all know, we did not change any of the tune. We did not customize it or adjust it. We kept it the same as the last dyno run. This way, we have a fair comparison of the two dyno runs before and after with the Motul Competition oil. And don't worry, the dyno has a self-correction system that will correct all the different atmospheric pressures and temperatures. So, let's get the dyno going. All right, everyone, we got the results in, but before I show you guys, leave a comment. Let me know if you think special engine oils such as the 300V from Motul really affect and make a difference on the performance of your engine. You know, that's a solid and valid question because it's not really supposed to be like, oh wow, I just gained 20, 30 horsepower. But if you choose the right oil, maybe your engine will work to the max potential. And that's why we are here today. Well, numbers don't lie and we have evidence. Max power, 728 versus the max power of all those dyno runs before, which is 725. And max torque is 982. Just a little bit more than the 980 we had before on the best dyno run. We can tell that the power did gain just a little bit and the torque gained a little bit. The graphs were very, very, very similar. Albeit the torque and the power were a little bit lower than the previous dyno session, but when it reached around 36 to 3700 RPM, it overtook the previous dyno run. So maybe the engine just started working better. I'm not really sure. I am not an engineer. I would say that you guys should do your own research, but from the dyno and from what we did, it proved that the Motul 300V did gain a tiny bit of power and a tiny bit of torque. So that is that. I am going to take the car off the dyno. I'm gonna enjoy this beast for a little bit. I hope you guys enjoyed this experimental vlog. It was actually pretty fun for me. Usually we like to go with big power mods, but you know what? Having a good oil change might make a slight difference. So I'm gonna go enjoy the car now. I'm gonna bring it back to my best friend. I might mess with him a little bit, tinker with the MG Flasher, but hey, I just wanna give a special shout out to Xiaohe Laoban at CPA Performance and Xizi. If you guys are looking for a custom ECU or a performance oil change, you guys know where to go to. Their link is down below. I'll see you guys on the next vlog, people. Peace.